Welcome back. It is time for Wellness Wednesday. So we are hanging out with Yvette and Tony, and we're talking today. And I love this topic. We're talking about the benefits of those early morning workout routines. I have to admit, I was never a morning workout girly, but now I am, and I really enjoy it. It's everything. They, <laughs> it's such an important part, and true disclaimer, I teach early mornings, yeah. so I'm a real proponent. But I thought it was a good topic to talk about as people transition as we earn yeah. spring, coming out of the dark season, mm -hmm. entering summer, and people want to set new goals and things, and, and the power of an early morning workout. Yeah. And what it does, not only for your body, but for your brain and your mental space mm -hmm. and your energy levels. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it really does. I love, I love how I feel after a morning workout, because I feel like, too, the hardest part of my day is done mm -hmm. oh, yeah. at that point. So I feel like you can really do anything else after. Exactly, it sets those endorphins off, so it makes, it gives you that internal boost. Mm -hmm. And um, I don't think anyone likes waking up no. for their early morning workout. <laughs> I mean, that's I still think a that's struggle. A general <laughs> Do you struggle? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I think that's a general consensus. Most people might not enjoy that getting out of bed part, but once you get out and you do it, it's so empowering. Yeah. And you might just need to down a few cups of coffee to, to get out of bed. I know for me, like it takes me a minute to wake up in the morning, but after I, I do it and I do the workout and I'm done, I'm like, okay, I feel really good. Like you said, those endorphins. Endorphins. And studies have actually found also helps with blood sugar control. Mm. Really? Yes. Because you're, you're get, again, getting set exercise. I mean, exercise helps with it in yeah. general. And so starting your day helps for the day. I love that. We're going to continue this conversation in our next half hour. We're going to start about how you can maybe incorporate or start mm -hmm. a good routine in the morning. So we're hanging out with these ladies for Wellness Wednesday, so you guys don't want to miss it. But stay with us. We will be right back after this. Welcome back. It is Wellness Wednesday. We are hanging out with Yvette and Tony. So we're talking about those early morning workouts, how they benefit us, and sometimes how hard it can be to start that early morning workout <laughs> routine. So there's some tips that we have for you guys. Absolutely. So yeah. one is finding a buddy. Okay. Finding or signing up for classes that actually make you reserve your spot. Mm -hmm. that's, <laughs> yeah, I think that's that good. is a huge benefit mm. of yeah. um, places like Goodwolf that, and there's a lot of different places where you can actually reserve your spot. Mm -hmm. So you're making that commitment. Yeah. Um, and then finding that accountability buddy. Yeah. Um, and setting your alarm. And some people, when you just get started with those mm -hmm. early morning workouts, sleeping in your clothes sometimes. <laughs> <it's>, <laughs> no. I have What's heard that. Yoga? Though. Yeah. I've heard I that. I mean, really. So when you're just. And realize wherever you are in your journey, sometimes you're in a place where you're like rebuilding or you're creating that new habit. So you might have to take some new things that are might seem a little yeah. unconventional. Mm -hmm. Set your alarm across the side of the so room. So it forces you to get out of bed. It forces I need to you to get that. out of bed. And once you start that habit and you start feeling those benefits mm -hmm. of you like, oh, I actually am thinking clearer today. I do like the morning workouts. Then it gets easier and you can sleep in your pajamas again. Yeah. But <laughs> to get started, that's a good way. That is a to good way. Started. And I like too, because you mentioned reserving that class. I mean, I always feel bad if I cancel the exactly. class. So I'm just like, mm, they're going to know that I canceled and then probably check in on me to see, <laughs> and if, oh, are you okay? If reserving a class isn't possible, also just getting, having accountability. Yeah. Having friends, having people that you meet with. I used mm -hmm. to run in the morning and I'd have a running group. And so you have people that you're actually meeting and holding mm -hmm. you accountable. Yeah, and I think that's the most important thing too because everyone could benefit from an accountability mm -hmm. partner. I mean, we see it all the time. Yeah, yeah. And how many days does it take to get into the habit? Is it 21? I think, I well, think 21 you do some days for to build 21. a habit. Yes. And so when it comes to the early morning, you might not, it might be a little too ambitious to say, I'm going to do it five days a week. Mm -hmm. yeah. But do two or three days mm -hmm. and just start building that habit and recognizing if you are waking up earlier, you do need to go to bed earlier. Yeah, you do. So you, you can't need that push sleep. yourself. Because otherwise like, you're not going to wake up. Mm -hmm. uh -uh. Been there before. And we are almost out of time. How can people learn more about Good Wolf? GoodWolfYoga.com. And Yvette? YvetteQuance.com. Y'all, thank you Easy. so much for hanging out <laughs> and starting this discussion. If you guys at home want to learn more, head to our website, KBM.com. But let's check back in with Adam Olivier. <laughs>